The INFJ, which stands for introvert, intuitive, filling, and judging, is one of the 16 layers brace personality types. They are the rarest of all personality types, accounting for only 1% of the world's population. INFJs are also known as advocates and described as mysterious, intuitive, and emotionally intelligent. In this video, I will show you 9 signs to help you ascertain if you are an INFJ. 1. They believe in all or nothing. INFJ is a curious mix of emotion and logic. They don't like to waste their time on anything inauthentic or superficial, although they may dabble in playing the field. INFJs are indeed about quality over quantity. They will become disinterested in anyone or anything they perceive as being fraudulent, dishonest, or wishy-washy. They are never on the fence. They may even have issues with other types of people who would rather stand on the wall than take sides. For INFJs, it is love fiercely or not at all, exercise relentlessly and eat well, or pig out on the sofa and eat junk food, work 20 hours a day for days on end, or sit and procrastinate all weekend like it's no one's business. As Rosa Noche Carey wonders, could it be that we INFJs are simply wired to do things with passion or not at all? Or does the middle of the road feel like a stagnant approach to living? 2. They exude warmth and make people feel immediately comfortable with them. Despite the complexity of this personality type, they have a very charming aura. Over time, many people have asked the question, why is being around an INFJ so relaxing despite their complex nature? One of the best answers to this question is that when you converse with an INFJ, you don't have to do as much personal work, the INFJ does it all for you. Thus, it is not uncommon for a stranger to sit down next to an INFJ and within minutes disclose their most personal secrets, fears, and dreams. This personality type has a knack for making others immediately feel at ease and are great listeners and trusted confidants who speak in human terms and meet others where they are. 3. They know things one perfect description which can be given to an INFJ is the one-liners from Game of Thrones, which was made by the character Tyrion Lannister, I drink and I know things. INFJs have a highly accurate sense of intuition that they've been sharpening all their lives. INFJs are known for vital insights about people and situations. They get these insights through the use of their dominant cognitive function, introverted intuition. An INFJ will, within minutes of meeting an individual, get to know their real character their true character. As a result, they tend to be more forgiving of their friends who exhibit unruly behavior because they can identify the real root of it, such as insecurities or past trauma. 4. They are introverts, but people who are not close to them see them as extroverts. Are you confused about the fact that deep down you think you're an introvert, but somehow you give the extrovert vibe? Well, here's the answer. People tend to confuse your personality because you're an INFJ. INFJs can be social chameleons and have an innate ability to blend into any social setting. The INFJ can be the life of the party for a night or two, showcasing their inviting nature and vivaciousness. However, this is never prolonged because, in introverted fashion, they lose energy when spending time with others. Those close to an INFJ know that this type can give a speech to thousands of people but cringe at the idea of mingling with the crowd afterwards. But then again, they will need to retreat home for some quiet time to recharge their batteries, or they will become on edge and exhausted. 5. They are perfectionists INFJs tend to be achievers, sometimes to a fault. They have deep insights into many aspects of life, and usually have very high standards for their understanding and accomplishments, as well as those of others, like a persistent shadow. Perfectionism makes the INFJ personality feel as if they always have to create an incredible result in everything they do. In their desire to be perfect in everything, INFJs use what-if questions as an excuse. A typical INFJ will always ask him or herself, what if I don't finish this today? Or what if this is not good enough? And the list goes on. Instead of being happy with what has been accomplished, they would instead push themselves more. This perfectionism can also lead to burnouts if INFJs aren't careful. 6. They are gifted in writing. Following their introverted nature, INFJs prefer to spend time alone and develop enriched inner lives with many hobbies and skills. This type has troubles conveying their emotions verbally, so they turn to pen and paper. Writing is a big deal for them. Journaling is a must for them because when they do, they can reflect on what happened throughout the day. This task helps to clear their minds and keep it all at list. This, combined with their creative nature, leaves no surprise that the majority of successful writers are in fact INFJs. 7. 
they are high achievers. If you want a task done right, hand it over to an INFJ. Their perfectionist nature can be applause to them in the aspect of getting things done. They will plan every detail and will deliver a glowing finished product. INFJs are usually high achievers and excel in academics and the workplace. They tend to put a great deal of effort into their work to get desired results. Co-workers tend to feel that INFJs are hardworking, positive and easy to get along with. However, when delivering criticism to this type, do it gently as they take every word to heart and are always striving for perfection. This type is a unique blend of dreamer and doer, but they can easily fall prey to extreme bouts of anxiety or depression centered on feelings of inadequacy or failure. 8. They are fixers. This type loves a good fixer-upper and with their ability to see the good bones of another person, their true motives and intentions, and to readily provide comfort and compassion, they often fall victim to the broken wing theory. This is the idea that they can rescue others who have a broken wing or who have been dealt a poor hand. This can be rewarding for the hopeful INFJ, but also frustrating and depleting when boundaries are overstepped. INFJs hate conflict. There is hardly anything they hate more than tension, unresolved issues and aggression, especially when it's between them and the people they love. INFJs, even though they know that life can never be smooth, they want everything to go smoothly. They want everyone just to get on, and they will do anything to fix situations, even if it means just glossing over the problem. 9. They see the big picture of things. This type tends to operate about 10 steps ahead, with introverted intuition as their leading function, INFJs prefer the world of concepts and ideas. They are more likely to have their head in the clouds than their feet on the ground. They are skilled planners and focus their insights on the end goal and what's needed to propel them there. However, while INFJs are off in dreamland about their futures, they can sometimes forget to be present in the world that is happening now. As a result, they do well with other more grounded types who can remind them to live in the moment. An INFJ can be challenging to spot because they are not prevalent in our society and tend to be reserved individuals. Nevertheless, if you can relate to this signs, you are an INFJ.